Oh God, take away any prejudice and whatever else may hinder us from godly union and concord. That is, there is but one body and one spirit and one hope for our calling. There is one Lord, one faith, one baptism. As there is one God and Father of us all, so, O Lord, may we henceforth be all of one heart and of one soul, united in one holy bond of truth and peace, of faith and charity, and may we with one mind and with one mouth glorify Thee. trying to stop them from dying. This isn't an intensive uh, care unit, it's an January emergency 6th. ward. The ICU is full. Brother, we're boots on the ground here. People we're moving have on only the campus now. I'll give you a... And they're in terrible shape. This is an absolute place to kill the attention. It's virtually out of the place. There, you know, it's been over well over a year already, and uh, and it's feel like home. You know, people here treat you like, you know, like your brother and sisters, like it's supposed to be. And from the first time we walked through the doors, the church has just felt like home. That we're all family, no matter what background or where you're from, what you look like, what clothes you wear, or anything. Everybody's family, like they should be in Christ. Because me and my mom, we were really looking for a church that we could go to and that we were going to love and want to come to every Sunday and all the other days. As I started coming here more, it, it, like, it feels like home, I guess you could say. This is his birthday. This is a day to be remembered. A day for high hopes. A day for renewed commitment that we shall be thine instrument in service and thy channel for a blessing through Christ our wonderful Lord. Amen. Amen. <laughs> 